come from a couple different places, so whenever someone asks me where I'm from, it's always a little hard to explain. But I started um, in Texas, so that's where I was born. Then moved back to Korea for middle school and high school. And then since college, I've been in the U.S. and now I'm in Asia for the last three and a half years. So I, my first entry into tech was when I joined Dropbox in SF and it was a really exciting place. So when I joined Dropbox, it was just one office and one floor in SF. So by the time I left, the business side had grown from just 300 to 2,000 people spread across 20 offices. So it was a really exciting time to be there. I found out about uh, Gojek when I was at Dropbox and when I first heard of it, um, so they told me that it's like an Uber for bikes and at the time I was quite happy at Dropbox so I was like, okay, sounds interesting. I had a trip planned to Jakarta. So I was in Jakarta and then I really, that's when it really hit me. So I saw all the swarms of Gojek drivers and the green jackets and the impact felt like very tangible, very real. And uh, we had planned a visit to the Gojek office at the time it was in Kamang, and then I met with the team. I was really impressed by all the energy they had and really the social impact and the mission they were trying to achieve. So I decided to jump ship and try out Indonesia. Um, so when I joined at Gojek, I started on GoFood as the uh, product manager there. Uh, at the time, it was a very small team. We just had seven people sitting at the Kamang office. Now we're at the point where we're doing over a million orders a day uh, across not just 70 cities in Indonesia, but also across the United States as well, and seeing the GoFu story multiply and the impact of the company itself. I love that Indonesia food. It's so diverse. But I really like trying all the Takiri mats, but I also love the, all the different soups. Probably my favorite is the Sotokutawi. One thing that I really uh, notice and <laughs> appreciate about Indonesian people is they're very scrappy and resourceful. More like a why not attitude versus a why. And uh, I have also it's very entrepreneurial in spirit. Indonesia is also so great for the travel, right? That there's so many places that you can get to. Uh, you can just hop on a plane and be there at a completely new place in an hour or so. But my favorite has been doing Mount Rinjani in Lopo. Don't be afraid of change and don't be afraid of making mistakes. Just take every opportunity you have as an opportunity to grow and learn and take your failures and appreciate them even more because often you learn more from your failures than you do uh, your successes.